what is going on guys it's Anis and welcome to this video where I'm going to share with you my plan to learn ethical hacking in 2023 so yeah if you are an absolute beginner this video might be helpful for you and if you are also or someone with some experience like me this video is also helpful for you so yeah um, the first thing that I want to talk about in this video is the uh, the book. The book I read recently entitled um, Joy of Mid-30s. And this book highlights the importance of patience. You need to be patient to, uh, to get good in something. And uh, this is something that I'm trying to be constantly aware of because we the youth are are in a hurry usually so we don't like the fact that uh, in order to excel in something you need to be patient and you need to practice for a long time before you can get there so same thing applies to ethical hacking and penetration testing if you want to be good at penetration testing you need to practice, learn, and be patient, and give it the time necessary. Years, sometimes decades, to be able to excel in it. And uh, the book that I mentioned earlier is um, one of the books that try to uh, highlight this, the importance of patience. And they noticed in some studies that in order to be really good at something to the point where they can't ignore you. This is a title of another book. We're going to talk about this um, in later video. You need to at least um, have 10 years of experience in some in, in any field you want. So yeah, if we take this and apply it to penetration testing, we uh, can conclude that you need lot of time because penetration testing is a vast domain so it might take you 10 15 20 years to be a master in it so first thing first be patient so yeah let's talk about my plan um last year i i was busy a little bit uh, writing some books and stuff but i was trying to uh enhance and work on my skills using try hack me uh, different paths whether it's malware analysis uh, web application penetration testing mobile etc and try hack me is a great resource for that so i'm i'm constantly playing ctfs and doing rooms in try hack me recently they launched the ad the advent of cyber 2022 i guess and it was a really fantastic uh, rooms to get started in penetration testing. Um, so yeah, this was my plan, very simple. I like to keep things simple. And uh, yeah, I enhanced also my ranking in uh, TryHack Me. You can check it out. I will leave the link in the description. Um, and I learned a ton using this approach. So uh, I don't like to be distracted with many resources. I usually use only try hack me. And if I need some theory and stuff, I go to open classrooms, uh, which is a great resource uh, for learning theory. And then I will practice what I learned in try hack me. Um, so this was the plan for 2022. And recently one of the one of the guys I know uh, in LinkedIn um, advised me to discover, you get it, HTB Hack the Box Academy. And I tried uh, Hack the Box Academy for one month. Um, I will do a review later on on the, on the channel. And it was amazing. I mean, HTB Academy, they did a really fantastic job explaining the different aspects of penetration testing, whether it's bug bounty or penetration testing, they have two parts uh, in there. So the HTB Academy, as I said, was really, really fantastic at explaining the different concepts. 
and uh, also the rooms they have a lot of rooms and uh, service to practice what you learn in the academy so which made me change a little bit the plan to adapt it to 2023 so in 2023 inshallah i will uh, try to focus um, on try hack me and htb and open classrooms i have uh, a couple of courses that uh, that are really interesting and that i need to learn in open classrooms including uh, how to manage seams um, and windows servers and also some active directory attacks so these are the courses that i'm going to focus on on uh, open classrooms and uh, this is the theory and then i'm going to uh, invest some time on try hack me which is important and then the majority of the time i would give it to i would invest it rather in hack the box academy and uh, for hack the box academy i'm going to first finish the bug bounty path um i'm, I'm maybe 30 percent um in this path and after that i will go to penetration testing and penetration testing path is huge in htb so it will take a lot of time but i'm willing to uh, to make the the, the the sacrifice or the effort if you want to uh, try to finish it before 2023 so this is basically what i have for the plan to enhance my skills um, even though I have other projects trying to grow here, the YouTube channel, creating new courses and coaching new uh, stuff. So it's not the only thing that I have to do, but uh, I'll try to focus on HTB Academy a lot more. So yeah, um, for you beginners out there, what I would say for you is to start with the basics, of, basics first. Uh, go to open classrooms get uh, your skills in linux python php mysql networking under the belt and after that you can go to try hack me with the free plan you can start playing some ctfs and doing some rooms um, and once you feel that you are uh, comfy with the different concepts and uh, basic attacks you can invest more and try to get the premium plan uh, it's not that uh, that uh, that expensive if you don't want to invest you can go to Vulnhub, download rooms and try to solve it, it it's it's that simple and uh, for people who are a little bit advanced I I I just uh, highly recommend going to HGB Academy and try to see different uh, sections, especially about malware analysis, reverse engineering, mobile penetration testing, and network penetration testing. So these are the most important topics in penetration testing, and usually they are a little bit complex to grasp. So yeah, this is it. I try to keep it as simple as possible. For me, at least, I have this pillar of uh, these three pillars: uh, open classrooms, try hack me, and HTB. Um, and once, hopefully, I finish these three pillars, I will uh, try to get a little bit fancier and uh, go from there. So yeah, this is it for me, and I hope uh, this was helpful for you guys. If you have any questions, you can put them down below. And uh, yeah, the like button and uh, see you next time. Peace.